Hi folks, uh, in this video we're going to be exploring the Leaven Line uh, which runs off the East Coast Main Line uh, at Thornton. Uh, the Thornton Junction was quite a, quite a substantial um, series of lines. Uh, there was a, a maintenance uh, shed and whatnot, and there was, a, there was even a station which was where the, the golf course is now. Um, and then there was a, a network of lines, one of the lines went along to uh, Weems, uh, and then of course we've got the the, the branch that heads along uh, past uh, Cardenden and uh, Dunfermline, uh, the Fife uh, Circular it's called. So in this video we're going to be heading up this way. Um, there was a line that come off uh, and head back this way. Um, I'll have a look in the maps. But headed off that way uh, towards what was uh, Balgoni Colliery, uh, and then there was a, a little line that cut in and underneath the main line, uh, in between the main line and the leaving line, uh, where there was another colliery. So we're going to go up there and have a look at that, uh, and then continue along the leaving line, um, heading along to Cameron Bridge Railway Station. Um, and continuing on uh, past the Fife Heritage Railway uh, until we get to leaving docks. So um, we'll see what we can find. Hope you enjoy the video and here we go. So coming off of the, the main line down this way, there was a branch line that came off and then headed this way and along this path uh, there was a colliery across this side uh, or part of the colliery was the um, what was the name we said the pit was again? Lochty side there was a Lochty side pit uh, here and then across the other side of the railway was the Julian pit uh, now this, there was a railway that went through here, underneath that bridge, and into the pit. Um, so we'll take a wee wander in there. Uh, we've already talked to um, a couple that own uh, the house in here. Uh, it was the old um, pitmaster's house. Um, almost a long time before they were, they were around. Jenny's showing off. I'm guessing this would be like an engine house or something like that. Yeah, I've got the cottage there. And then obviously that was some sort of, you know, shed. There's a lot of bricks in there, in the road here. And then there's the beginning of the rails. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Spider ah. What kind of spider do you think it is? I don't know. You don't know? You're the expert. Oh, yeah, don't touch because it's rusty metal. What's this a spider web or something? Yeah. 
Oh, that was fun, mate. Look. Mm. 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 Could be in a gate or something. Mm. Yeah. So in there, and among all that uh, growth, uh, there were a couple of cottages, uh, known as the Julian Cottages. Um, it's obviously too overgrown to have a look in there just now, uh, but it's maybe one that we'll come back and have a look for. Uh, as for the rails, and the way they disappeared, eh? they're there. There's one. There's the other one, so they're going. No, they're pretty much going the way that we're we're heading. So keep an eye on the ground. See if you see them again. So this this track that we're following here, um, it's nothing to do with that, Joel. Well, I wouldn't say it's nothing to do with it with a leaving line, but it wasn't, it was a branch that came off the line, um, and it just so happens it's easier for us to walk this way than it is to go through the trees and bushes. Um, That there is a, it's a signal post by all looks at, or it's been a signal post. I'm not climbing through those nettles, but you know the railway is just beyond there, you know, beyond this fence. Uh, ah. Look. Look oh, it's a stink bug. A shield bug. Wherever love goes, there is also misery. It's no mystery. And you and I, we got history. Yeah. Also tragedy when we're in too deep and you and I we got history yeah.
long leaning place. Yeah. There's a sleeper through there. Getting used as a fence post. Oh, there's a truck. Still there. Now there's the brackets. The sleepers are still there. And the rails have been lifted. And the rails have started up again. That answers the earlier question. The second track was on this side. Oh, B. Come along a wee bit more with the railings on this side. And on this side, got like a retaining wall that's got like a decorative edge on the, the carton stones. There's a truck in there. So then obviously the second truck was this path and the hoses. That's the end of the railing. A bit further along. Now the wall's going up. Sandy would be absolutely kicking herself because a couple of the big trees up there are squeaking and creaking with the wind.
don't know how visible it is, but I think if you look in there, you see a fence post and a gate in among all the overgrowth there. Um, and this is marked on the map as uh, there was a level crossing around here, so my guess is that that's the remains of the gate. I mean, obviously it's just been a, you know, like a farming level crossing or something. Um, Thank <laughs> you.
Dewa. D E W A R. Dewa. 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 So with the, the reopening of uh, the railway, uh, Cabinet Distillery, uh, Diageo, have been in discussions with, uh, I think with Network Rail and whatnot, about possibly reopening up their line. So you can see beyond there, there's a line that would have went through these gates and into the, into the distillery. And then obviously there's other tracks here which serve the distillery as well uh, and then we've got each side of the platform for a uh, you know for passengers and the last time I was here it was uh, it wasn't as overgrown as this and you were able to see like another, it was like a good platform across that side. Um, it has been three years. And then there, there's uh, the base of shelter or something, which was here. So at the top of the steps that would have been there, um, it comes up onto the bridge. Um, obviously it would have been different back then. Thank you, Davy. Sleep up. So when they come to reopen this, they're going to have to replace a lot of sleepers. Well, in fact, they're going to probably replace them all. But I would think that they're going to keep the rails. I wonder why that's like that. What? In that one. Maybe then you forgot which way it was, so I put another one. Look, they're missing here. But then there's more of them there. Still more for there. Yeah, but none of the other tracks have got them. Like that side doesn't have them either, it's just this side. Hmm. 
There's another lever. Mm -hmm. Would have been there. Mm -hmm. There's a Oh look! I wonder what was there? A little maintenance shed or something maybe? Have a look on the map! Hmm, well maybe I'll have to have a look at other maps to find out what that was Just a little building at the side of the the railway Shows the uh, Here's a wee bridge going over a wee burn. I think it's kind of wee burn. Because um, there's a junction, or there was a junction further up, um, over there. And we'll get to it when we get along there. Um, but it's now like a pathway that goes under the, the main road and heads up towards Kennaway. So this, I think, is probably Kennaway burn. Because you've got the Kennaway Den up that way. But you can see with the uh, with the bridge being quite wide. That was the kind of one of the signs that this has been you know the double track all the way along. You see some of the, uh, the bars are being replaced. Mm -hmm. Don't know how how recently that happened. Uh, I never, to be honest, I never paid attention. The last time we took a walk along here, I'm gonna have a look back at the video and see whether I noticed. So I don't know whether they've been done in preparation for them clearing this up mm -hmm. or what. Look at this thing. Yeah, it's a dam. Like a waterfall. Uh -huh. And Davy's been finding <laughs> Davy's been finding uh, ladybirds. Loads of them on the track ballast as we're walking along.
Okay, so um, moving on from where the Kennaway branch of the line would have went this way, um, it comes down, or it would have come down, but beyond here there's a wall. Um, I tried to look it up on the maps and try to get a bit more information on how things were laid out, but it does show that there was like a separation between the, the lines that were here um, and the Kennaway lines uh, and there was a siding that continued on um, uh, down to a signal box and um, the leaving, it was like a leaving junction it says on the maps uh, again I'll, I'll post it up um, probably be looking at it right now while Davies having a look for uh, raspberries um, so, here, I don't know if you'll see it in this lighting, but in here there's a, a wall with a decorative edge and it continues on quite a bit, so we're going to keep walking down here and see if we can get a closer look at that. Remember, don't eat the ones that look mouldy. And check them for bugs as well. like we say the maps indicate that the, the Kennaway line uh, came off and up that way um, but they must have been separated by so they were guessing that they were either elevated or behind this wall um, So we see this wall, and there's also a second wall there. So my thinking is you would have the two tracks here. You would have a side in, in here, and then this is probably, well, possibly just a containing wall to save. You know, obviously, the houses weren't there at the time, but to save whatever was up there uh, from slipping down onto the onto the track. We see what we think is the ruins of the, the signal box. So obviously kind of the wall comes down here and then across and then comes down there. So obviously we would have had some sort of front to either that or that was you know the, the signal box sat on top of this. Don't know. I'll have to look into that. But there we go and we'll continue along here. Right, so we've walked along following the line, the line continues on and goes off this way towards uh, Methyl Docks, right? but this this part now is a, a branch line, whereas the main line itself, which run through to Leaving Station um, and then continued on to um, London Links and, you know, goes on to Ely, Creole, um, so the line then went this way and it doesn't quite follow, here we've got here the Fife Heritage Railway, it, now it follows uh, what was the Kirtland Sidings, um, but the line itself went through there, kind of followed this hill through and then goes uh, through a weekend industrial estate uh, and it went under the main road and then you had uh, the leaving railway station. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to keep following the um, natural branch now and heading towards um, Methyl Docks. So there it is. This is the path that we followed. And then here is the existing line. Um, which you probably can't see very well. I mean, there it is there. Um, and then we have this overgrowth. There you go. Now 
Then here. There's a base. My footbridge was here. So I'll put the photo up. Also, there's no point me trying to try to get in the same position um, as where the photo was taken because there's no way I'll get to it. Um, but there's other supports. Four of them there. Got one, two, three, and then I'll be a fourth one. You can just see behind it. So here's the line for the, the docks and there's the Fife Heritage. So we've got the railway in here, continuing for where the footbridge was. Oh, oh, strawberries! Wow! Right, wait a minute, let's have a look. Oh, oh, yeah, that one's ready. Mm, kind of. Yeah, I'll check this one, okay? Yeah, they're all right. Mm. Mm. Yum. Yum. Sometimes they're like, not that big. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they're that big. Yeah. More strawberries, teeny strawberries. There we go. Yeah. Beastie in my head. <laughs> Where? We're going back to the car. Oh. This is the way back. Oh. There's still no sleeper. Oh wait, there's, there's sleepers there. But the, uh, the rails aren't connected to them. Now they are. So 
there's that section there where the rails are there, but the Again, we've got another section here. It's missing its rail. Well, the rails, the rails are off. But, uh, they're still there. What we've also got beyond these trees is a. Uh, wire fence there with uh, concrete reinforced concrete posts so it'll be the original <laughs> but caught something So across here, it's the Fife Heritage Railway beyond there. So there it is down there. And also this is the, the line that we're following. Then you want down there. Well on that way. Yeah, I know it's not about it. It's 
this is the sawmill bridge. There's what's left there. A lever for points. Possibly, or is that another signal? I don't know. Because the points are back there a bit. So it's a weird place to have the lever. Whatever it is, it's no longer connected to the, the railway in any way. So. Is it a ladybird? <laughs> See, whenever you pick up bugs, you can never put them back. It's like they don't want to leave you. There you go. Possibly a bolt for the railway. Maybe there's fishies in it. No, <laughs> no, there won't be any fish in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well. So here, this uh, this bridge over a wee kind of burn or sewage outlet or whatever. With the two tracks still. But if you ask me, mm. it's kind of wide for just being two tracks. So I would think there would be another. You know, by, the, by this point, we're talking about actual sidings into. One there, one there. Yeah, I know. Actual sidings into. Factories and whatnot that were here. So we'll have a look in the map. I'm probably looking at it right now. We've got Those two tracks are now, yeah, points there that yeah, there's points there. Those two tracks have went into one now. But obviously, um, what well, other? You know, there were other lines that were in here at one time. Now I'm sure I've got footage and a uh, Sure, I've got footage uh, walking along that bit um, when I did a video with my dad. So uh, you might be watching that just now.
So, after going under the bridge, the railway comes through these bushes and then over this bridge. So, beyond the bridge, um, it heads on past the uh, Bayview Football Stadium and there's, you know, some industrial um, units and whatnot along there. Um, so, I mean, there, there's a few things along there, like the remains of a level crossing uh, and some um, some old footbridges. But we'll leave that exploring until another time. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and share and we'll catch you later.